I want 25% of a taco. You can't divide up a taco. It'll destroy the taco. 25%. Nobody eats just a quarter. Clean up, burps. 32 seconds into the flight, the three liquid fuel main engines soon will throttle back to 72% of rate. 0.01. That's 1%. It's also 1 one hundredth. 26% is equal to, well, if there are 100 percents in one, then 26 of these percents is just gonna be 26 out of 100. What is going on here? Well, think about it. 100 percents equals one. That's the same thing as 100 out of 100. Think about pennies. 100 pennies equals a dollar. So 26 pennies or 26 out of 100. Now, you can also write that as 0.26 on the same note of pennies. You can say 0 0.26 or just 0.26. That was too easy. Let's do another one. 67%. If there are 100% in one, this is the same thing as 0.67. And you can put the optional zero there so that you reinforce where that point is going. 0.67. Two-thirds is commonly written as 0.67. It's called rounding up. Or, in that case, 67%. Now, if you actually write out the division, you'll get 0.66666666, and they never stop. It just keeps repeating itself. That's what we call a never-ending repeating decimal. 0.78. Well, again, there are 100% in one. 100% is equal to one, which is the same thing as 100 out of 100. <laughs> so what is 0.78? Oh, this is easy. This is simply just 78%. Now, we're gonna see a pattern here. Let's investigate. We're offering half off subscriptions, and if you've already subscribed, that's half of half or one quarter. You won't find a deal anywhere else like this. Subscribe today. The Greater Gators class slash the bonus episodes are a paid upgrade. Certain exclusions apply for residents of California and New Jersey. See the link below for details. God bless. But what happens when you have a fraction? 47 out of 100. Now, 100 one hundredths 